Ten bad bitches in a mash. Rich so many rock them diamonds on me dancing. When you working hard, then your money start expanding. I got model bitches wanna lick me like some candy. I'm not gonna say anything to that because I'm not gonna be the reason the nigga hair fall out. Exactly. So, I'm not the reason, I'm not, I, I'm not condoning this. This is not a tutorial. I'm coming to you today from a, from a different kind of place in my life. A place of, uh, desperation. My hair is... Shitty. Yeah, it's shitty. Like, so I've been looking up moisture overload, and I think that's what I have. My hair naturally takes a long time to dry, even with no product in it, okay? No product, my hair takes forever to dry. Straight out the shower, my hair takes forever to dry. Um, so with the product added, it still never dries, and then I wake up, and my hair is wet. I mean, I go to sleep with wet hair, and I wake up, and then it's mushy and matted, and it's like got product buildup, and it's just like I have to wet it and wash it again. So it's just like a very unhealthy cycle of hair washing going on and my hair never dry like as I'm taking my hair out this ponytail I did not put any water in my hair yesterday and it's still wet like what so my hair lately has just been feeling like mushy and like gunky and just nasty so I realized that it was moisture overload and I need a protein treatment <sighs> Sad thing about it is that I'm in Japan right now and we don't have anything at our little store that we have that has protein in it. Like the Afoji, like protein keratin, two minute reconstructor stuff. We don't have that. All I got is some eggs, some mayonnaise, and some uh, yogurt. And uh, I've read mixed reviews about using that kind of stuff in your hair because some people say that the molecules are too big and all this other mess. So I went out yesterday and I looked as far as I could and I got this Diva Curl Build Up Buster. I am not sponsored by Diva Curl, and this shit was $23, okay? I was not happy about that, <laughs> um, but I am willing and kinda, I told you I'm kinda desperate to get my hair back. Girl, I'm, uh, my circulation is going on my finger. It's, it's, it's a tourniquet. Where you at? How you want me to fix this? What you mean? I don't wanna take my finger out, cause then, so you you'll lose it. So what you want me to do? I'm going to pull the hair through. This way? Yeah. You can't pull it. Ah! I'm just playing. <laughs> here. I'm cutting that. No, one. come here. No, I need this rubber band. It's a nice big rubber band. Do not cut my rubber band. Ah. Ah, you feel you ripping my hair? I'm not ripping your hair. You know what I'm saying? Oh, got... my finger. Hey, this is so cool. I got a fat neck. Look at that. How you doing that? Look. Ugh, it do look like a pack of hot dogs. <laughs> no, I do not do that. I ain't brushed my teeth. Uh, <laughs> I love you. I love you too. So, uh, basically, my hair is like not dry in the middle right here. Baby, yes, baby, come here right quick. What's up? Touch it. Feel it. Yeah, that's not nice. That's wet, right? That's more than wet. But it's mine. <laughs> <laughs> not funny. What do you put in your hair? That was already some boo boo on your hand. No, it was boo boo in your hair. That's no, that was boo boo on your hand, and you touched my hair. That's just smell like vinegar and like. It was supposed to uh, do his draw after. Bah! The my hair's not bouncy. It's frizzy. My curls are just not the same. It's wet in the back. I ain't wet my hair in two days, so I'm kind of annoyed at this point. I'm gonna try to do this build up buster. I don't know what I'm doing. Ugh. That is nasty. Ugh, look at that. Ugh. So this is not really like a tutorial thing. Like this is like a like definitely like a vlog thing. Like don't. This is not a tutorial, y'all. I'm not teaching y'all how to do this to y'all hair. Because last night, while Maz and I, I was researching and I was like, babe, I gotta go to the, we have this store out here called Don Q. And I was like, I gotta go there, you know, I gotta see if they got a protein treatment for my hair. He was like, baby, we live in Japan. I'm like, yeah, but all hair needs protein. So I'm like, they got protein. And he was like, oh, it's wet right here too. And he was like, um, and he was like, um, oh, well, don't leave me. It was late. <laughs> don't leave me. Don't leave me here by myself. But he didn't want to go. So he was like, why don't you just use my protein that I use for my protein shakes? I said, like, your whey protein? He said, yeah, use my whey protein. I was like, no, Miles. It's not hydrolyzed. He was like, 
fuck you mean it's not hydrolyzed? We only got hydrolyzed protein over here. I don't buy that $18 shit. I buy that $30 like going off on me. I'm like, this could, this could work. So I took some, I have some um, European clay. I always got knockoffs of shit because I live just in the middle of nowhere. Um, but actually I got that when I was back at, in Virginia. I got that clay because I was like, I went to the thing and it was like, oh, you know, I don't have the Indian healing clay. I just ran out of that. But he was like, oh, I ran out of that. So I don't have any of that. But uh, you can try this. It's basically the same thing. So I have the European clay. And then, of course, I have the apple cider vinegar. Um, and so I figured that I would mix all of those up together. And then the protein is chocolate protein. It's chocolate. So the chocolate and vinegar smells like total absolute doo-doo butt together. And um, I'm trying it. I tried it yesterday on a small piece just to make sure my hair wouldn't fall out. Miles was like, you ain't gonna put it on the root. Only put it on the root. I was like, no, Miles. Oh, this kind of has a slimy consistency. What? This is like water-based. It's got some water in it. Yeah, it got water in it. I don't need no more water. Yeah, I don't want no more water. Get that shit out of here. It's got a lot of oils. Then it's got a lot of shit in that I can't pronounce. So I'm going to just massage this in. And then I'm going to make my, uh, then I'm going to make my, uh, what's that thing called? My concoction for y'all. <laughs> I think I did like equal parts clay and protein. And then I did, um, double vinegar and the consistency was gross but it worked so this actually feels like i'm washing my hair like this feels like a like water and shampoo mixed in a bottle i wonder if i shake it if it what wait a minute y'all see how like slimy it is it's slimy it seems like super like moisturizing i don't know i'm just doing i i really want the 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 uh the, I really want to do the concoction, but I'm just doing this as for to be extra, I guess, because I paid for it and it was $23, so I'm gonna use it. Man, I was mad yesterday when they when she said uh, $68, and I said, what the what the hell? I bought lotion, shampoo and conditioner, this dang on thing, uh, deodorant, and a top coat, and that thing came up to $68. I was so mad. Not because it was just came up $68, but I just feel like I ain't have $68 worth of stuff. Okay, now to tackle these ends. Okay, I'm gonna try to put it in my hand first. This nozzle is so... So actually what I plan on doing is just doing my whole head like this and then rinsing it out so my hair can be wet for the... So actually, I'm just gonna do this all throughout my hair and then I'm gonna wash it out. I'm gonna get in the shower and wash it out or just kind of lean over the bathtub and wash it out um, so I can get my hair wet for the mask. And then after that, I will, um, after that, I will put my mask on my hair and then take my real shower because that shit stinks. And brush my teeth <laughs> and be a and be a normal human being I'm not sure what that did or if it did anything it helped up here but I just feel like it made the product wet again and then just dissolved I don't know we'll see honestly this just feels like shampoo it might be some shampoo it says it's a cleansing serum serum so it is shampoo so basically, I'm shampooing my hair right now. I'm gonna stop right here and then I'll just come back to you guys when I'm about to wash it out. Okay, so I just finished doing the um, build up buster. Um, my head is kind of itching a little bit, just a little bit to itch because it's wet. This this is water. It's like a sh like a pre shampoo treatment. So it's just I didn't realize that it was like a pre shampoo. I mean, I guess that works. Um, but I mostly put it on my uh, scalp and then I massaged it. Now I'm massaging it and um, I put it on my hair too, but of course that didn't get, it didn't get everywhere it was supposed to go. So let's just go wash this out right quick. And then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna make my concoction 
and then we're just gonna see what's up from there the directions say just to wash this out and condition your hair so I guess I can just wash this out and then just do the uh, the mixture Really, bro? Are you, that, are you that much of a jerk? Are you? Are you that much of a jerk? Huh? Little boy. Hey. Are you that much of a jerk? Really, man? Huh? Why are you talking to me? Okay, y'all. That, my hair actually looks like a lot better than what I thought it would look. I tried to record myself um, getting it out, but you know, Tyrone had to come through. Actually, it's not even all the way out. My hair feels way cleaner, actually, and it looks way better already. That's crazy. It looks so good. You ever had to tie your towel up in a bun? All right, so I have my plastic bowl. I have my Fugazi uh, Indian Healing Clay. It says European Clay Powder. And I have my husband's protein. So I'm gonna take two scoops. Actually, I'm not, I'm just gonna take like, I'm just gonna measure it, measure it in scoops. So that's one scoop of protein. All right, so that's two scoops of protein. Mouth said he'll use all his protein, but three scoops of protein, let's do four. But this was his idea. This was Miles' idea. Okay, now it's thickening up, so I'm gonna have to use a lot. The consistency isn't where I want it to be, but it's not bad, so I'm just gonna start. Ugh, look at it. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my gosh, that is the grossest texture ever. This is not gonna work as good as it did yesterday because it's not like clay-like texture, but I'll still try it. Cause I gave it some opportunity. It sat on my hair and it dried up, it hardened. It's not gonna do that this time, I see. I gotta hurry up because Tyrone has an appointment at one and it's 10. This might take a while. Probably shouldn't use the white towel for this. It's okay. Okay. So, I'm going to bring y'all back when I'm done, okay? Ah, uh, I got fucking shit all over my shit. So, <clears throat> this is my hair after I'm just done. Um, I did end up running out of mixture and I just end up mixing just the protein powder and the vinegar. So, I mean, I still don't have as much as I need, but I'm really trying not to use all of my husband's protein. I'm gonna have to buy them some more anyway, but I'm kinda like done with the process. My uh, towel's dirty. My neck feel gross. So I need. I'm gonna wait for this to dry, and then as much as it can dry. Cause yesterday it hardened up like clay, but I don't think it's a, it'll do that because I put too much vinegar in it. Um, but I think the mixture will still be able to penetrate my hair and do all of that good stuff. <clears throat> I'm gonna say this one more time. This is not no tutorial. Don't go home and do this. This is me out of desperation living in Japan. There's other products out there that will work better that's not homemade in your kitchen. Okay? Okay, cool. Oh, let me show you the back. Okay. I'm gonna wait for this to dry. It is 10.30 right now. I don't know what time it'll be when I come back, but I'll let y'all know. Okay, so I'm about to hop all the way in the shower. My hair is like kind of dry in some spots. It's really stringy. Um, the places where I only put the protein at don't look like they're gonna do much. It don't look, it's actually really like sticky and it feels frizzy and, but it feels dry. Like it hardened a little bit. Like you, it's flaking off, like it's flaking off right here. So it definitely hardened and it's sticking to my skin and my scalp feel tight. It's in my mouth. Um, 
So I'm gonna go wash this out. I actually bought some Shea Moisture uh, shampoo because somebody mentioned that my Tresemme shampoo was not meant for my kind of hair. And so maybe I need to stop being so careless and actually kind of listen to my hair and take care of it. So um, I'm gonna go wash my hair, condition my hair, and wash my butt, and then I'll be back. No, that's what I'm saying. I'm gonna go after lunch. <sighs> I had to wrap it up in a in a. Uh, Are you gonna be ready for his appointment? Yeah, yeah. I had to wrap it up in a this your t-shirt. I bet it is. And I owe you thirty dollars. I bet you do. What you do? You use all of it. You use all of it. I didn't use shit. all of it. It look good though. It do look a lot better. It looks a lot better. How was it in your hair? Did it like, was it nasty? My curl's still not as springy as they should be. Was it nasty in your hair? It was hard and gross and just... Just nasty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See if my hair still smell like it. Mm-mm, it -mm, real good. Thank you. Okay, so, I used the uh, Shea Moisture um, shampoo and conditioner the what is that coconut and hibiscus I think that's it or shea butter and hibiscus Some, somebody so I tried to dry it off as much as I possibly could right now I'm just sectioning off my hair into three big sections and hair tying them my curls look so much better Ugh. So after this, I think I'm gonna like protective style until I can um, get my hair back to its regular state. Um, so that way I'm not putting any moisture on it like at all. Well, not any moisture on it at all, but it needs more protein than anything right now. So, um, okay. So I'm just gonna use the uh, Curls Creme Boulet, um Whip Curl Cream. Just gonna put that on every I'm just gonna put that one here and the reason why I decided to go to this for it because I think that the Shea Moisture the Curl Enhancer Smoothie is like too heavy sometimes so I'm just gonna use this and put enough of it so I can feel like my hair is actually moisturized and not so dry looking I'm gonna try to separate this to further moisturize my hair. I wanna wet my hair, but I can't find my spray bottle. So also, what I wanted to do is, I wanted to like shampoo with a sulfate shampoo, but I was scared because I was like, that's too much. Like you already doing the protein and the apple cider vinegar, and you already doing the, you know, the clay, so. Just using like a soap, a sulfate shampoo would just be like too much on your hair. But if this doesn't work, that's definitely what I'm gonna do next time. So if my hair goes back up in braids, don't be surprised. <laughs> Pray your hands, these curls back to life. Okay. Done with that section. Okay. We can't find a spray bottle. I don't know where it's at, but it's my last section, so I just wet it a little bit in the sink. Pray your hands. Pray your hands. Pray your hands. Wrap that one up. I don't know what I'm gonna do next. <laughs> not doing anything really. Still feel like it needs a, a little bit more moisture. I feel like it's gonna dry dry looking. Hold on. Okay, so I kinda let my hair air dry a little bit after I put in the um, Curls Creme, Creme Brulee um, moisturizer. And then it was, you know, I was trying to get with just the moisturized curls look, but I can't help it. I gotta go to work tonight and I just needed some extra something so I end up I think I end up putting olive oil in it and that's why it's so shiny and then I put in uh some I define my curls with some um the flaxseed uh and castor oil gel by eco styler but I did not do a lot my curls are very much still soft and moisturized they're not crunchy or hard 
Um, this is going to take a little while to come back from, I feel like. So, yeah. Like I was saying, I feel like this is going to take a little while for me to come back from. So, I'm definitely going to go back into protective styling mode until I can get my hands on a proper protein treatment. Because I am struggling, sis. Struggling. Okay? But so far, I mean, I think that my hair did good. I'm just waiting to see if it dries all the way. It's still a little bit damp. But I literally just finished it like 20 minutes ago. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this homemade ass video. Not homemade. Struggle. That's what it is. Struggle video. Um, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.